please pause this video and answer the question before continuing. Okay, in this question, we want to determine what percent of the rooms have cable TV and a kitchenette. Now notice that we have a population of rooms here, and there are two criteria associated with each room. They are having or not having cable TV, and having or not having a kitchenette. As such, we can solve this question using the double matrix method. So let's reserve the top row for rooms with cable TV, and the bottom row for rooms without cable TV. Next, we'll reserve the left-hand column for rooms that have a kitchenette, and reserve the right-hand column for rooms that do not have a kitchenette. Now, since we are not told the total number of hotel rooms, and since the question asks us to find a certain percentage, let's say that there are 100 hotel rooms altogether. Now, our goal is to determine what percent of the hotel rooms have cable TV and a kitchenette. Since this box represents rooms with cable TV and a kitchenette, all we need to do is find out the number of hotel rooms in this box, and we can then answer the question. So let's add a star to this box to remind us that this is our target box. Okay, now let's see what information we can add to our diagram. Well, the question tells us that 30% of the rooms have a kitchenette. So the sum of these two boxes must be 30% of 100, which is 30. Now, since there are 100 hotel rooms altogether, and 30 of them have a kitchenette, the remaining 70 rooms must not have a kitchenette. So the sum of these two boxes must be 70. Moving along, the question also tells us that 80% of the rooms have cable TV. So the sum of these two boxes must be 80% of 100, which is 80. Now, since there are 100 rooms altogether, and 80 of them have cable TV, the remaining 20 rooms must not have cable TV. So the sum of these two boxes must be 20. Now at this point, there is one last piece of information that we can add to our diagram, and if we fail to spot it, then we cannot answer this question correctly. What can we do with this information that tells us every room in the hotel has cable TV or a kitchenette or both? Well, since every room has at least one of these features, this box here, which represents rooms with neither cable TV nor a kitchenette, must contain zero rooms. At this point, we're almost done. We can conclude that since these two boxes must add to 70, this box must contain 70 rooms. We can also conclude that since these two boxes must add to 80, this box must contain 10 rooms. Now we could go further, but our goal is to find the number of rooms with cable TV and a kitchenette. We can now see that 10 of the 100 rooms meet those criteria. So we can now go up here and enter our answer of 10%.